Ichiro Oda's long-enduring manga and anime One Piece is quite easily one of the most captivating stories ever written and with the incredible, careful story writing and world building, it's not a surprise to see it as popular as it is today. Being a shonen manga, One Piece has had its fair share of fights. Even though they aren't the biggest selling point of the series, they're incredible nonetheless. Over the years, Luffy and his crew have been in countless battles and they've delivered some incredible action for the fans to enjoy. Among the sword fights and swashbuckling the series has to offer, here are some of the best battles in the series. Some of them have earned their spot for pure spectacle, others for story importance. And there's that grand few that are here just for their ridiculousness and intrigue. Prepare for spoilers below. Hey anime lovers, today we will be taking a look at my top 8 best One Piece fights so far. If you enjoy this video please be sure to like and subscribe down below and without further ado let's get right into the video. Number 8 is Luffy vs Doflamingo. Beyond simply being the first time we see Gear 4 on screen, which remains one of the best power upgrades in the whole series, the fight in Dressrosa against the diabolical Doflamingo is one of One Piece's most significant events. Few One Piece villains have had as much build-up or developed as much intimate terror as Don Quixote Doflamingo. When Luffy finally stepped up to bat, it was a grand crescendo of catharsis for those just wanting someone to wipe off Doflamingo's self-centered smirk. This was another warlord battle for Luffy, as he faced someone that was both a natural haki user and an awakened devil fruit user. Having to pull out all the stops, this fight is most iconic for the debut of Gear Forth and the King Kong gun. Luffy. Number 7 is Ace vs Blackbeard. Ace's great search for Blackbeard finally ended on Bonaro Island in the Grand Line, where the two fought to their heart's content. The fight gave the fans a clear look at the abilities of both Ace's Mera Mera no Mi and Blackbeard's Yami Yami no Mi Devil Fruit abilities. Ace threw everything that he had Blackbeard's way and managed to injure him quite a lot as well. However, Blackbeard was simply on a different level compared to him. The fight ended in Ace's failure, which triggered the biggest war in One Piece to date. Number 6 is the Scabbards vs Kaido. The nine red Scabbards finally got a chance to take Kaido down after waiting 20 years to revenge Odin and the fight certainly lived up to all expectations. With incredible teamwork, they were able to deliver some serious injuries to Kaido, which is a big deal in itself. What's more, they followed it up with their Odin 2 sword-style attack, called Paradise Totsuka, which weakened Kaido quite a bit. Unfortunately, they didn't have what it took to defeat Kaido and ended up failing in the end. However, their effort was commendable nonetheless, and certainly made for a great watch. Number 5 is Zoro vs Mr. One. The best Zoro fights in the story came against Mr. One in the Alabaster Arc. Having been met with a match for his power, Zoro tried his best to prove himself by cutting through Mr. One but failed initially. With Mr. One holding an advantage in the battle, Zoro spent the majority of time on the back foot and suffered great injuries in the conflict. Thankfully, he managed to grasp the concept of the breath of all things and learned how to cut steel. Immediately afterward, Zoro sliced Mr. One apart to win the battle. Number 4 is Luffy vs Lucy. 
Eni's lobby gave Luffy one of the most difficult fights in the story so far. To save Robin, Luffy used every ounce of energy in his body to take Lucy down. He created two new powers in Gear 2nd and Gear 3rd to combat the powers of the Rokusiki. Despite that, Lucy was able to put up an incredible fight against him. In fact, his Rokugan was enough to leave Luffy on death's door, but in order to rescue Robin, Luffy pushed beyond all his limits and delivered a ferocious Jet Gatling to Lucy, defeating him in the process. Number 3 is Luffy vs Katakuri. Luffy's fight against Katakuri is one of the most action-packed fights in One Piece to date. Katakuri was Luffy's biggest challenge in the new world up to that point. And defeating him was certainly not an easy task. Luffy spent about 12 hours getting beaten by Katakuri in the mirror world just to enhance his observation haki. By doing so, though, he was able to learn how to see the future itself. That, combined with the power of Snakeman, allowed Luffy to overcome Katakuri and finally take him down in battle. Number 2 is Law and Kid vs Big Mom. Big Mom was a major opponent in the battle for Onigashima. Although taking the Toby Ropo suggested that she wasn't explicitly on Kaido's side, she was more invested in defeating the Straw Hats Rebellion. After being separated from Kaido, Big Mom squared off against Trafalgar Law and Eustace Kid in a battle that tested both of their abilities to the extreme. The fight was an epic one since it was among the few instances where a non-Straw Hat character fought an opponent of major narrative significance. It helped to establish them as Luffy rivals rather than as generic allies of convenience. Number 1 is Luffy vs Kaido. Without a doubt, Luffy's clash against Kaido remains one of the very best fights in One Piece to date and will potentially go down as the greatest fight in the entire story. On the rooftop of Onigashima, Luffy showcased his newfound abilities against the Yonko and managed to fight him in a toe-to-toe -to -toe battle. To make things even better, Luffy lost to Kaido twice on the rooftop, which massively increased the stakes. The fight between the two sees some of the very best action in all of One Piece, along with some of the most hyped transformations. Carrying the burden of an entire country and the promises to his friends on his shoulders, Luffy put his life on the line to take him down. And that's it for the top 8 best One Piece fights so far. Please make sure to like, comment and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.